If you've used a spreadsheet, then you've used a file type known as a CSV. This is a spreadsheet and under the hood, it's probably stored in CSV format. When you download it, it's gonna have a .csv extension. I've downloaded that spreadsheet and it looks like this. And now we can look at why it's called a CSV. CSV stands for comma separated value. And what it looks like is this. If you compare them side by side, you can see that each of these columns is separated by a comma when you look at the file. And every row of that data set is stored on a new line. And that's the format of a CSV. You have files which have many lines representing many different records, and each of those lines contain values separated by commas. So that's a comma separated value file. But typically you'll get a CSV file and the first line in each column will have the name of what that column represents. You might also hear of other file types which sound like CSV, like TSV, and they're just different separators. So instead of a comma separated value file, you might have a TSV file, which is a tab separated value file. And so if you download that, you'd see something that looks a lot like this, except instead of commas, you'd have tabs, and those indicate the separation between the different columns. I think you can also have other types as well. Um, I don't think they have specific file type names, but you might have like a pipe symbol representing the difference between different columns, um, or really you could have any separator to represent the difference between the columns. CSV is a really common data format. You're gonna see it everywhere. If you've used spreadsheets, you've already used it, and you're gonna see it all the time if you're handling data. It's probably the most common format to store tabular data. And in these tabular data files, you can store any type of data. The cells, that is the different column and row combinations, can contain any data type. So they're really flexible, really widely used, and you've got to get used to using them.